Hey YouTube, um, I'm coming to you guys with an actual video of me dumpster diving. I know the other day I made one, I was playing Dishonored, and I saw you could get, get in the trash bin, so I thought I'd make kind of a funny video. But now I decided I'm actually going to show you um, me dumpster diving, and today's Friday, and so usually I go Fridays and Monday, because on Mondays it's so hard to get to the stuff that they would have put on Friday because there's so much stuff in there. So yeah, let's get right into it. It's about 2 o'clock. In the afternoon, I think, something like that, just about. So yeah, it's kind of right here in front of everything, which isn't my favorite thing ever, but I have um, my ice scraper to access anything that might be hard to get to, and as you can see, there's some DS games down there, looks like some kind of stand, um, a Wii stand down there. Looks like there might be a game in that case. It's hard to tell though. Let's check over here. See if there's any GameStop bags. And the clear ones are GameStop bags. So um, let me just get around over here if I can. Um, looks like there's some kind of white guides. But I want to pause the video now. Um, I might record. Later. Hey YouTube. Um, this video is gonna be another GameStop dumpster that I finds. And yeah, let's get right into it. So I knew this outside because some of the stuff I just found still has some snow on it. So I didn't really want to bring it in the house and get it all wet. And so yeah, let's start off with everything over here. Now what's ironic about all of this stuff over here, it was in a box outside of the dumpster. So I honestly think maybe one, one of the employees want people to look for, um, or you know, like didn't want the garbage man to take it and because I get caught there one time so maybe I'm, I'm not saying he did but maybe just maybe he left it out for me I'm not sure but um there's a Wii charging dock um I didn't see any of the battery things that went with it but I mean I'm sure it works you just gotta find the battery backs and I found um a Wii um intercooler it looks like and but there was snow on it so I don't know if it will still work I got an official Nintendo wheel, three of those sleeves, one's for a remote plus, a Wii stand, and this was kind of cool, it's like this Dream Gear uh, racing wheel, and then just this is just the case and manual for Reader Rabbit, and this I found at a different GameStop on Wednesday, and I, I was going to upload the video, but I accidentally deleted it, so um, I found all these PC games here. And most of them are complete. This is the only one that I that didn't have a disc for, but they threw out the disc separately. So there are all the discs that came with it. Then there's another Wii sleeve. Um, in that bag is just a whole bunch of gift cards I found. I tried a few. They all had zero dollars, so I'm not gonna try anymore. Um, I found six, I believe. Yeah, six of these FIFA 13 cases, which is really cool. And I got this Bioshock sleeve. And I'm planning on getting Bioshock for the 360. And usually GameStop throws out these. So it's nice to find. And it's in really good condition too. We need the dumpster. And I found Connect Adventures. They like to throw this game out quite a bit. Um, what else did I find? I found a DS Light case. And then what's ironic is I found this in the dumpster. And trading uh, DP Arrow Productions for three of them, but uh, you know I love steelbooks, so I'll probably keep a few and maybe sell the others. So, um, and then I found this wipeout case, and I think it has the manual too. Yeah, and I was gonna save this for last, but you guys can already see. Yes, I did find a copy of Black Ops 2 in the dumpster. Now let me show you. It's very lightly ringed and I tried it out and it's currently unreadable but the guy, this, me and this guy have been doing a lot of business at, he runs a CD shop. I trade a lot of CDs and DVDs. I pick up at garage sales for cheap and I think he said he has a disc resurfacer so he might be able to resurface that for me for free. So that'll be pretty cool. Then at that same dumpster, I found like a brand new DSi XL box. Yeah, it's the box only. And it came with all the manuals and stuff. 
and it did have the Nintendo codes in there. And then this was sitting out in the box of snow was the Club Nintendo points. It's either for a Wii or Super Mario Galaxy, I'm not sure. I kind of think it's Super Mario Galaxy. And I got another DSi XL box at the GameStop dumpster I went to today. And it has the reward points and everything that came in. And it also has the stylus. So, um, that was pretty cool. And then, at the same dumpster, the one where I showed you guys I was at, I found this stuff. Just a whole, whole lot of DS cases. So, I haven't checked to see if they're complete. But, um, usually they are. So, I'm just going to go through them like that. I'm not even going to bother reading them. Unless they're blind and want me to. Then I will, would do that for you guys. Um, set these two things aside. Nothing that special. Maybe, hopefully that will have some Nintendo points. As will that. Hopefully that will have Nintendo points. That one too. Yeah, they had cases of pawn cases in one of the bags that was in the dumpster, so I can sell these for usually a buck a piece, believe it or not, at the flea market to this one guy. Alright, so that's all the DS cases I found. There's not much more I found. I found Modern Warfare 2 manual and a ripped up cover art. It was all crumbled up, but I figured I'd just take it. Then I found a Wii stand with the silver thing in the bottom, I guess. And then I found Resident Evil 6, disc 2 for the 360. It says voiceover pack. So I don't know if this came in like the anthology edition and it has like all the DLC. Um, but actually, no, it looks like it just, um, for different languages, I guess. That's my guess, but I thought it was still pretty cool. It's in really good condition. There's just a little bit of, like, snow got on it, so it's, like, almost, it's, there's no scratches, so. That's pretty cool, and I just found some batteries and gift cards that I might try out. Looks like there's one more game over here. Touch defective, so. Alright you guys, um, that's about it. If you liked the video, just leave the thumbs up button below. And as always, have a great day. Hey YouTube, um, this video is just a little update to the end of the game set dumpster finds. I forgot to show you, I said at least to the side. Um, this is a uh, Do Not Discard, and they discarded it. Um, Xbox 360 um, retail kiosk disc. And it's still sealed, never been open. So um, I think that might have some value. One day, I don't think it has a lot of value right now, but to have one of these still sealed, wait a few years, I think that might be interesting. And also, I don't really know what this is. It says PS3 system software version 4.21 um, slash W only, so I don't know what that is. Um, I don't know if I'm really going to put it in my PS3 to find out, but um, yeah. And those are all the Club Nintendo points I ended up getting within the last two days. So, and these two, I believe, are like 160 each, considering they're from the systems, and most systems, they give 160 points each for. So, that is pretty cool. Hopefully, they all work. And, um, yeah, just a little update to the end of that video. So, um, again, you guys, if you like the video, just leave a thumbs up. And, again, you're going to be hearing this twice, but have a great day.